Hey guys, Nick from Gallery 7, and a little while ago I did a very quick video on cutting mats, and I showed you my $125 really inexpensive mat board cutter that I use for everything I do except for big oversized mats. So here I'm cutting a big oversized mat, and the problem people have, there's a mat board cutter, uh, I think it's called a Dexter, it's a little handheld, beautifully made aluminum thing that you hold by hand. The problem is people would get that and then they just take a regular ruler and try to hold it on the mat board and it's really hard to push hard enough to cut without a ruler moving. So in order to cut big mats, and you can even do this at home if you don't want to get a mat board cutter, this is just a piece of um, aluminum from Aubuchon Hardware, much cheaper than buying an eight foot ruler. And I've got a block of wood here and a block of wood at the other end. So when I'm cutting like this, if the ruler can't move, it works perfectly. And now we're going to cut the last cut. I've already cut two of these. And I just line my ruler up with the line on the mat board that I've drawn for my borders. Also, in another video, we'll talk about how to measure mat board, you know, measuring the border and all that kind of stuff, which has been greatly overcomplicated by all types of people. So I would enjoy doing a little thing on how to measure. Okay, I'm right on the line. And just like before, that little red mark, I'm going to line that up with this line, which is a starting point. And when I cut, I'm not cutting now, but when I cut, I'm going to stop right on that pencil line. Red line on the pencil line. Okay. Make sure I'm lined up. And there we go. Now, when you take the mat board out, it's easy to kind of dent the little thin edge of the mat board. So slide it very carefully and lift it straight up. And there it is, all cut. And we'll show you this job when it's done. Thanks.